What's up guys? Today we're going to be breaking down the old engine out of 350Z. Hey, just for fun, you know, just see what's inside here. The chaos on the side, we're probably going to see some, some broken stuff in there, so I'm curious if we're going to tear it apart and see what happens. Yeah. Like I was saying, this is just for fun, so we're not going to do this in any kind of order or any particular way. I'm just going to tear this thing apart. I know we got some stuff that's probably still good, like oil packs and sensors and stuff like that. We'll try to hang on to that stuff. And I got my two annoying friends in Dino, they're hanging out. They're going to help. So if you hear some weirdness going in the background, that's going to be one of the three. Dino, come on, you yeah. here? Come here, Dino. Oh, Dino, don't be shy. Yay, Dino, puppy. YouTube wants some cookout, we're leaving. Yeah, bring me back the cookout tray. Oh, no, 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 no. Little no, no, no. big double burgers. Let me check my wallet real quick.
them piston motors, because you know I can go wrong, I can move the parts, and now he's like, 350 Z, hell this hole, and can't go wrong. That's because rotor is junk. Yeah, you tell them that all Nissan is a little low. Have you got that one to believe me? I'm always like Nissan. <laughs> Don't threaten that camera with your rotating blade. <laughs> the 20 turbo 300 always oh, like, no. I, I need to go find an old video of him like, rotary, three million parts, reliability, V8 jump. We got a header bolt that uh, thinks it's an option, so we're about to cut it off. We're about to cut the camera yeah. off, probably.
It's a craftsman. <laughs> hey, it didn't break. It's, yeah, it didn't break. <laughs> We couldn't get the front pulley to come off because it's been a pain. We don't have anything to like stop this from spinning. We heated it, big breaker bar, impact, whatever. Well, so basically flip the motor, take the oil pan off and look at all the carnage in here already. It's like it's just chewed all kind of stuff up. Look at that, that's, like a, that's gotta be a piece of piston. I mean, that is ridiculous. Dude, there's a bolt right here just chilling. That's definitely a rod bolt. Just like hanging out. Dude, there's another one. Look at that. Yeah, this motor's good. I told you that. That's a little that's an issue with the Nissan. Oh, that's a piece of piston right there. Piston like a oil ring right here. I don't think the hole was in the block. I think it was in the oil pans. Oh, I doubt it. No, no, let's see. Dude. Huh? Yeah, I don't think it's blocked. Probably not. But yeah, that, that's crazy. I mean, there's just like so much metal in here. But we're going to pull this pan off and hopefully we can wedge something in there so we can get the front cover, to get the uh, front pulley off so we can get the chains and stuff loose so we can get the heads off. Um, but I just wanted to show you all that real quick. This carnage is crazy. mess going on right now there is just oh i mean all these little chunks just fell out of this thing i mean this is ridiculous i've never seen this much carnage look at this that's part of like the girdle right there look at that it just exploded and that's a big chunk of metal now i'm pretty sure look this right here this is one of the retaining pins retaining clips for the uh the wrist pin or you know, rod pin whatever look at that. that's crazy that's part of a piston. Jay, dude, look at this rod cap. Donald, look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is ridiculous. That is some serious freaking damage. And this is the side right here where the uh, the rod tried to make its escape. Man, that is wild. It almost looked like the bolts were backing out, and that's what caused this. And my friend was saying that it is a common issue with these, so... I would believe it. <laughs> I think it's just Nissan motors in general. Yeah? I know, like, you know it's like an issue with the RB25 and 26. The rock uh, bolts, the rock cap bolts. Like yeah. That. That's some serious damage. I've never, I've seen plenty of blown up engines before, but never this much metal and chunks of stuff it's it's crazy we're gonna keep digging into this thing and uh see what else we can find well i got down to the block and the damage Devin just removed this piston this thing looks mm, tasty this thing looks awesome we got this side over here let's see if we can get our work on there that stuff just falls out the bottom of the motor. It's still in one piece. <laughs> yeah. Jeez, look at that. A little bit of tape and it'll be all right. Yeah, that's all I need. A little JV wheel. Should be back at it. Yep. Like I said, I'm sure some something could be saved out of this, but... Um, we just did this for 
Maybe Farm your water off. pump's the only thing that's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that crank pulling bolt, that thing is tough. So we're just, uh, this was just all for fun. All this stuff's going to the scrap yard. So. Look what they did to my screwdriver. <laughs> can't, that's why I can't have nice tools. It's a craftsman. Yeah. Well, craftsmen don't break. <laughs> that's pretty much it. Like I said, we just hang out in the garage, have, them, have a little fun, seeing the damage in this thing. But right, I guess that's it. See y'all on the next one. Hold on, show them this picture first. Say bye. Say bye. Come on, Chair, with a new video for you. Don't worry about that, guys. I'm going to edit that part out. I can't cut it all out. Oh, I can cut it all out. <laughs> You guys are so funny. You have dino 